Hi guys, welcome to Origin. Um, quick video this time, and it's about generalizations. Um, a lot of people, especially a few high-profile YouTubers, um, have defended making generalizations about groups of people because, and I, well, I'm, I guess I'm paraphrasing what they might say here. My audience understands that I'm not talking about everyone in that group. I'm just talking about some of the members in that group, or most, or just a few. But, you know, and how dare you insult the intelligence of my audience? But here's the problem. Generalizations do work. Now, I don't personally know exactly how it works. Maybe it's, maybe it's a subconscious effect if you see a label and it's constantly associated with negative stuff, even if you know, you know, even if you have an understanding of the nuance behind how it's used, it still has some effect on you, maybe. Or maybe it's just the fact that there are people who genuinely don't grasp the full nuance of, you know, don't grasp the context in which the generalization was being made, and don't understand exactly how widely or narrowly it's meant to be applied in that particular circumstance. And what ends up happening is the entire group does get tarred with the same brush. And the end result is the entire community suffers. We don't need to look very far to see clear evidence of that. I mean, people get attacked for being in, you know, I guess, uh, demonized groups. People, you know, what, what was the Holocaust if not the exact result of that? I'm fed up of these arguments being made. I, I just wanted to make that point because I've I've heard this a few times and well I've, I've not seen anyone else address it so let's get it out there. Uh, what do you guys think? Thank you for watching. Goodbye.